Tom, exciting season ahead for women's rugby in Ireland. Yes, absolutely. Um, you know, obviously starting with the Six Nations uh, coming up uh, in a couple of weeks' time, which is our main focus. But um, you know, once that's over, then we've got a, we've got a lot of planning to do with the uh, with the World Cup in August. You brought in a, a quite a few new faces in the November series, and some more new faces announced in the squad now. You're really building, aren't you? Well, yeah, that's obviously one of our, our, our primary goals. You know, obviously with uh, with with the team as well to to perform, which is uh, which is absolutely critical to win every game or try to win every game or prepare to win every game as much as possible. It is about building a, a player base that can uh, that can handle a Six Nations, which is uh, which is going to be a lot of a uh, lot of lot of hard work and and, and big attrition uh, attrition rates. So it's um, it's it's one of our key goals, and I think we've done very very well. Obviously, results haven't gone our way in uh, in November, but um, the bigger picture is that we've got uh, we've got exactly what we needed from a, from a squad point of view. You mentioned the Women's Rugby World Cup, obviously a huge thing for Ireland to host that tournament. Do you do you look forward to that, or do you kind of put that back a bit and just focus on the first game? Well, that's it. You know, obviously, um, you know, it's 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 in August. Um, it's it's going to come up very very quickly now. But um, there's no there, there's no thinking about that right now. It's uh, it's about the first game, and we try to keep that as much as possible. It's about the first game in the Six Nations, Scotland away, who are going to be very very difficult, and uh, we're not going to underestimate them uh, any at all. So it's um, it's purely about the first game in the Six Nations. It's um, and, and there from then, then it'll be the next game after that. So it's a one game at a time principle and mentality that we're looking at, and uh, and hopefully that'll hold us in good stead. And, and once the Six Nations is over, then there'll be time to plan for uh, for what's ahead. But uh, it's purely down to the first game.